Family, friends, and the community coming together tonight to honor and remember Mahogany Jackson, a 20-year-old who was found shot dead early Monday morning, just a day after she was reported missing. Police say she was kidnapped, murdered, and sexually assaulted. A candlelight vigil was held for her tonight. Seven people have been arrested and charged in her death. We're just really taking it day by day. Um, for me, I'm more at peace a little bit um, because they got everybody like within 24 hours. And tonight, city leaders are asking the public to help a family who is already going through the unimaginable right now. Taylor Pollock joins us. And Taylor, what are they saying tonight? Yeah, that's right, Steve. Brittany, the story is very hard to listen to, and it's impacted not only Jackson's family and friends, but even total strangers who were shaken by this shocking crime gathered today to honor her life and legacy after police say she was held against her will and tortured before she was killed. BPD have arrested seven in connection with her death and have said some of these people recorded some of that attack on Jackson. We're hearing reports now that video is circulating online. That video was described yesterday by law enforcement as heinous and disgusting. Tonight, Jefferson County's district attorney is pleading with the public that if you come across that video to not share it out of respect to the family. She has to live with this forever. Uh, I mean, there's some aspects of this situation I know that's uh, devastating to their family. But then to see it reenacted on a video is almost places you there. And then to see people continue to share it over and over. Uh, and I know some people uh, may be sharing it for entertainment value or whatever, which is sad in and of itself. But at the end of the day, have some respect for them as well. Um, have some respect for the family. Have some respect for Mahogany. And police have said they're confident that they have all of the suspects in this case. Steve.